Let's go to the next question. Okay. Be aggressive on that one. Just be aggressive and lead aggressively. Yeah, funny how you mentioned UFC. Because you can kind of, in that regard, you can learn a little bit. Because you can hear, like, you, you always hear the coach or whatever yelling, saying, be first, be first, be mm -hmm. first. All you kinds know? of stuff like that, yeah. You definitely don't hear him say, hey, sit back and wait to get attacked. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> they, they, you don't hear him say, okay, be defensive. Yeah. Or be passive. Yeah, yeah. yeah exactly. It doesn't happen. Next question. Um, some jujitsu talk. What type of style do you play? Aggressive, passive, reactive, or smash and pass? Et cetera, et cetera. Et cetera, et cetera. Well, I mean, I've trained with you. You probably, you know, have an assessment, your assessment of my game, which will be a limited assessment, by the way, because yes. the game that I show you is the, is the, is built to contend with what you bring to the table. Yeah. If you brought it something else, you'd see something else. Yeah. And, and I'm a little bit beyond that because I witness you and Dean all the time, uh, more so before than nowadays, but. Yeah, I would say my assessment. Yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. So you watch me roll watch with other roll. people and yes. you can see. So you yes. do see that I train different ways with other people. Yeah, yeah and really that's really the core of the evaluation is that you tr you when you roll with people, you it's like your real um it's like variable style, mm. you know? It changes. So, and it depends your mood too. <laughs> Like if you're just messing around with me or whatever, you're like, you know, how this is kind of weird, but you do this thing that no one really does. And you huh. look like you look me in the eye, like while you're rolling. It's weird because I know you're just messing with me. Like, oh, <laughs> like everything I do, you're like, oh, that was cute. Kind of, <laughs> kind of, kind of an attitude. And then, you know, if I talk too much, um, you know, whatever, then you'll, you'll yeah. smash and pass. <laughs> so in regards to these, these choices, um, all, all, all of the above, right? So, so passive when you're kind of taunting and maybe even learning or not is learning. Is taunting a style of jujitsu? Yeah, yes. <laughs> yes, it is. It's your style. <laughs> and so you'll be passive kind of waiting for me to do something. And then if it doesn't work, then you taunt some more. And then, so that's passive. And then <laughs> reactive is obviously, you know, reacting to anything that I try to do. Aggressive is when either time runs is running short or I talk too much, and smash and pass is the result of that aggressive stuff. In really, in replace of smash and pass, oh, I mean, I think the alternative for me is is a little something that we like to call the disrespect. Right, the disrespect. Yeah, yeah. which that, is when you just completely disrespect the person's guard and just pass and smash them. Yeah, mm, yeah. yeah, the disrespect for sure. Um, yeah, and I think I think the key point for this for me is is that I I know like I I agree with you like I have a decent guard I'm I have a good top position I'm pretty good at guard passing whatever I'm not I'm not great at jujitsu but I'm decent at some areas and I'm pretty one thing I am is I'm pretty comfortable like in oh, just about any situation there's no situation where I'm there's no situation where I'm freaked out. Mm. Like, I don't mind being in half guard. I don't mind being on half guard, top, bottom. I don't mind being guard, closed, open, whatever. I don't mind being mounted. I can pretty much handle any situation. Mm -hmm. You know, and again, when you're training with Dean, right. it's, it, you know, you get, you get very comfortable with people because you have a guy that's just a savage. Yeah. And, um, but, but what's, what's interesting about this is, for me, and I, and I talked about this. I mean, I talked about this. There's a dichotomy here, right? Like, mm -hmm. if being aggressive is not working, then you have to try that other game. You know, I always say if you're if you're trying to pass someone's guard really close and you can't do it, mm -hmm. back away right. because there's an opening there. And it's the same again. It's the same thing with life, right? Mm -hmm. If you're beating your head against the wall, try a different route. When there's one door that's closed or heavily defended in combat. Go find another door. Go breach a window. Go find another way. There's an opening somewhere else. And I think that's what my game is. I think that's what my game is. Is it's, like you said, variable. Yeah. Based on a, a variety of influences. Both in my world and in my opponent's world. Yeah. And surprisingly, and I think that people, a lot of people wouldn't really assume this right away, is that you're, um, yeah, sure, you're going to smash and you're aggressive and kind of rough, a lot, you know, a lot of times. But you're like um, like a playful 
jujitsu guy. You oh, know? I like, was going to say this, and this is, I think this is important. I had a guy ask me, how hard do you go? Right. And the answer is very easy. I go just hard enough that I'm staying ahead of the other person. Now with you, so if those of you that are listening on audio, Echo's making a face because there are times when I have to step up my game a little bit and, and yeah. put the wood. To... Times where it's straight up, that's not true. Yeah, yeah, okay, okay, yeah. But there might be some, oh, you know why? That's because you come in with, you, we, sometimes you come in with, a you know with an attitude of yeah I can see it in your eyes you're like today's the day mm -hmm. and yeah. you come in there and you got the the serious look on your face and I oh, okay cool it's gonna be like that right on mm -hmm. and so then I, yeah I have to bring the heat a little bit yeah so, yeah fully yeah but that same and this is the part where I think is kind of kind of interesting is that you do it doesn't seem like a war like it seems like a war but all within the confines of some silly game not silly but some game. Well, it is you know? a game. Yeah, but but it's it's obvious though. You know, like I, I think that someone who maybe never seen your role or never had that experience with you specifically, they would assume that you're this like heavy minded oh, oh, guy who's smash like, it. I'm gonna smash yeah. and that me and that I am taking yeah. this really seriously. You yeah, know? yeah, yeah. No, I. Because some guys are like that. Yeah, that's true. It's not that I don't take jujitsu seriously, but jujitsu is fun to me. Right, it's so fun to me. Yeah, and I think that. The better you get, the more fun it gets, and the yeah. less you have to be like that, you know? Yeah. And I don't mind when people come at me like that, because I still get to do the same thing, you know? Right. I still get to have fun. Yeah. And, yeah, no, jiu-jitsu should be fun. Yeah. It really should be fun. The funner it is for you, the longer you're going to do it for. Now, part of the fun can be submitting people, and you get people that that's the only fun that they have in jiu-jitsu is when they submit people, yeah. and that's not what I'm talking about. Yeah, I think that's kind the of The transitions waste. and the... The, the flowing and the utilizations of moves and the cool things that happen. And, you know, sometimes I'll be rolling with whoever and, like, something just so, – like, someone will do something really cool and you start laughing like, right. man, that was yes. awesome. Yep. That's jujitsu. That should right. be – jujitsu should be fun. It shouldn't be this uh, – it shouldn't be – it, it shouldn't be – the fun shouldn't come from just submitting people. Right. That's just bullying, right? Yeah, in a way, yeah. And, yeah. you know, you shouldn't get, you should, at a certain point, you go, you know what? Okay, cool. I can tap people out, but let's, let's, let's do this for the reason of the sport itself, the, the, the game itself, which is a fun game. Yeah. Fun I know guys to who have told me straight up that when they're driving up to the gym, they have anxiety. Yeah. Like anxiety. Like, oh, how good am I going to do? Or if they get tapped out, it ruins their day or their week or whatever. Yeah. But no, man. I have none of that. <laughs> yeah. No. I'm rolling to the gym just in totally yeah totally happy to be to be getting there and get and get to do something that's so fun yeah yeah i rode with the uh, chris martin today yeah for and it was all like you can make jokes you can talk trash and you can do all this stuff while you're rolling mm -hmm. and doing that in this playful way i mean don't be a dick you know but yeah, yeah, yeah. but you know just like how, how yeah you can you can push being a dick sometimes <laughs> it makes it more fun for yeah, sure like yeah. you can you know, you can call a move and then do it on yeah. the guy if you're better than him or whatever. Wow, and it ma but right it there. makes it fun though. Yeah. You know? And me and Chris, we're we're doing that the whole time. I'm like, oh yeah, watch this. Ooh, 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 how's that feel? Kind of thing. Yeah. And of course that's taken to an extreme because I know Chris yeah. for a long yeah, time. We're friends. But fun. talking smack. just a little bit of that makes it more fun. Just yeah. like if you were playing a video game, just like if you're playing any other game, you just talk some friend. You know, it's it's part of the fun. Yeah. And like I said, my original point is I think people wouldn't assume that about you, given how you may come off mm. sometimes. But you're really like that. Mm. No, jujitsu is fun to me, no doubt. Fun sport, for sure. Believe it or not, jujitsu, in a way, like w when you're surfing in mm -hmm. California, there, there's a there's a much harder vibe surfing in California yeah, than there too. is in the mats, yeah. for sure. Oh yeah. You know when you know when we're surfing where I surf, like. It's it's a gang mentality type yeah. situation, oh, yeah. you know? Yeah. And so on the mats, it's just so fun to be in a situation. But, and surfing, you know, leads to fighting often. Oh, yeah. And so, but in jiu-jitsu, the fighting is already happening. Right, right. <laughs> so, yeah. so it's, you know, you can, you're kind of over it. And yeah. now, now we're just, we're already fighting, so now we can just chill. Right, yeah. 
Yeah, sir. It's crazy how surfing's like that, right? It's supposed yeah. to be this kind of zen no, thing. No, it's kind not. of, but no. Yeah, no, it's supposed to, but it's not. It's an aggressive. It's a very aggressive environment. It's like a territorial thing. It's too, a yeah. very territorial thing. Yeah, okay. yeah. I, it's kind of cool. I like it. You liked it. <laughs> 